Hi everyone, welcome to our podcast. Today we have a special guest, Ma Jianping, a Chinese weightlifting and weightlifter coach. Hi coach, welcome to our podcast. Hello everybody and hello and uh, this is uh, Coach Ma. Uh, my name is uh, Jianping Ma, the people call me Coach Ma. I'm the former uh, Olympia for the team China and uh, I compete uh, right. the Olympic 1984. That was uh, the first New China delegation to compete in uh, uh, Olympics uh, in the history. So I'm also former uh, head coach for USA University national team, a former head coach for Seychelles Great. national team, and also uh, I used to coaching in Anhui, China, for the as a mm -hmm. head coach. Yeah. And uh, currently I'm a master world champion, world record holder, and I compete. Uh, last wow. five years and uh, come back to train to compete after 35 right. years from my retirement so i enjoy to uh, compete training and coaching and uh, i'm the founder of ma weightlifting i have a new company called ma weightlifting and uh, the coaching right. chinese weightlifting techniques worldwide and all, uh, my schedule of this year is uh, fully booked so I'm now starting uh, start to book for next year now. So people enjoy uh, uh, to learning the Chinese weightlifting and making me busy because I'm one of the resource that uh, uh, people Asha. find me want to uh, uh, want to like uh, work with me for the Chinese weightlifting techniques. So I'm very happy to be here to sharing my long time Chinese weightlifting experience. And uh, if anyone have any questions. I will be more than happy to answer any questions you have. Okay. So anyway, <laughs> you can. Uh, thank you. Yeah. Thank you, coach. Mm. Thank you. That's really mm. impressive. It's very interesting mm. uh, CV as a coach, as an athlete. And I've seen you are also coaching in many countries, like in Asia, in oh, Africa, everywhere. in Europe, yeah. in the state. And now the good thing is now you are uh, teaching your experience, your training uh, system to the young uh, coaches. Uh, as you see, coach, uh, Chinese weightlifting in uh, last Olympic got an amazing result. You know, it was a, I think they got almost all the uh, gold medals. <laughs> yeah. So what's the, yeah, what's the Chinese weightlifting training system secret? Why Chinese weightlifting is that much successful? I think uh, this come from a long, uh, the story, no, because a uh, long uh, history, we have a uh, many yeah. uh, uh, generation to build this system, and uh, actually, 1960, 1970s, uh, 1980s, China weightlifting, yes. at that time, they learning uh, little by little from the uh, different countries, especially Europe. Yeah. Okay. But at the beginning, yeah. they're learning from uh, America as well. But uh, eventually, they're learning yeah, yeah. from uh, Bulgaria, Russia, and the East Europe. Yeah. Yeah. So little by little, they they created our own system. Yeah, one, yeah, my coach, yeah. name is a uh, coach Zhao Zhao Qinghui, and her uh, and his yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, like brother in law is also one of my uh, one of our head coach. Both of them are. Yeah. Uh, a co-founder of a Chinese weightlifting. Yeah, I was lucky that to learn Just, from them. Yeah, both of them they're coaching me before, and uh, but uh, most of the yeah. time I uh, I train with my coach, uh, Coach Zhao. Yeah, he passed away in uh, two thousand eight after Beijing Olympics. Uh, yeah, before he so sorry. before he died, I invited him to uh, to uh, uh, present uh, like do uh, invite him to US. Do the seminar with me. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So Chinese weightlifting is a long history, and uh, just uh, I mentioned that we learn from beginning, uh, uh, be, uh, learn from yeah. Europe be, at the beginning, but eventually they create our own system. Uh, this system, if you say what is the difference, yeah. I will say this is a long term uh, uh, the, the uh, history they built, and the experience yeah. they make a lot of research, you know, the techniques, training method. Yeah. Yeah, and, yeah. Uh, so yeah. now I would say Chinese weightlifting is uh, getting mature. So all the uh, yeah, yeah. all the athletes they're trained by the professional coach. That this is a uh, is a 
one of the best weightlifting system in the world. And uh, you can see that uh, yeah, all the sure. athletes, professional athletes in China, they train yes. by the same system. Uh, if you go any like a school, like a sports school or provincial team or yeah. any other uh, provincial, like a professional team in China, they train yeah, yeah. under the same system. So this system, because they're very, uh, they, they use it very successfully for many years. So, but they they live and they're still learning, they're still developing. Yeah. Because now, yeah. uh, China, they have, uh, yeah. I think weightlifting is one of the uh, largest sport because of the Olympics, because of the medal they, I think they so. have. So, so if you yeah, win yeah. China, like, like I said, let's like yeah. say top three, you probably will win the Olympics for yeah. sure. So, especially the lightweight class, you know, yeah, the lightweight class is uh, yeah, yeah. China is always uh, number one. So <laughs> for many years, well, yeah, yeah. So this sport. Uh, they influence all kinds of uh, other sport because uh, weightlifting yeah, we can see. is a yeah is a strength sport or we can say speed yeah. strength sport not like uh, other like uh, for yeah. example like a uh, bodybuilding powerlifting yeah yeah, yeah. but weightlifting yeah. is uh, different this sport not only the absolutely yeah. strength they also have yeah. speed strength endurance coordination yeah right mobility yeah exactly you know and also the mental mentally so this sport now people recognize that yeah when lifting they they can make a body total conditioning yeah so this is a yeah, great sport sure. that the other sport to use for their training for their uh, strength training you know when i go everywhere for seminar so people have a yes. lot of questions for me. They also, they also like you just ask, what is the secret? You know, I will say, yeah, the yeah, training yeah. method is one of our secret, the system. So they always follow the yeah. situation, the recovery situation. Yeah. So as the athletes, as yeah. a coach, when we training, we have a program. The program yes. always follows the situation. So a different. Uh, background different different experience some people are even different uh different age no uh, uh even yeah. the gender differences are also training in different yeah. men and women are just mentioned about men and women are training different yeah, yeah. men you really yeah good at absolutely strength women good at more yes. like uh uh details such as like uh uh, techniques, no yeah. mobility. Men can train yeah, yeah. heavy right away, but women will train heavy little bit, little uh, little bit slowly. But the women good at yeah, yeah, endurance, yeah. different. Women uh, good at the endurance. Yeah. Men yeah, get yeah. the fatigue earlier. So when we when we prepare for the program, so we always always recognize that men. Since they have a, a different uh, situation, such as they get fatigue, and uh, also for program, you have to understand the kind of training more than three weeks heavy. So usually they train two or three weeks heavy. They have to back, they, they have yeah. to uh, follow by one week light or a couple of days light yeah. to get a recovery. But women yeah. can stay longer for heavy training because the women endurance better. So this researched by team China yeah. women's team long time ago, about 20 years ago, we, uh, China, uh, we did a lot of research. We found that, uh, every year yeah, yeah. before COVID pandemic, I, I organized, yeah. uh, uh, China international weightlifting camp. So, uh, the campers yeah, yeah. come from uh, worldwide. I have so many students from uh, everywhere. Include, include Middle East, yeah. Europe, uh, or everywhere people. So when we go to China together, I told them this. Uh, yeah. Yeah. They see the, they see the, uh, the true, they see the rules. For, uh, they see the uh, true yeah. story, true situation. For example, the men, they train, for example, three o'clock in the afternoon. But the women 
yeah. the train two thirty already. That's like a thirty minutes earlier than men. Earlier. So when yeah. when men done the training, the women still there training. The women still there training because of the endurance better. For example, if we win ninety percent, for yeah, example, yeah. for snatch or Canadian jerk, ninety percent. For example, even the squat or deadlift, men can stay around ninety yeah. percent for six sets. A woman can stay for ten sets. They can train it longer. And uh, yeah, yeah. Wow. so this is a yeah, you're right. Yeah, reason that uh, women, men, are training difference because of the endurance different, because of the recovery different. When I say men yeah, get yeah. fatigue earlier, but the men has also has a difference than women that get recovery. Men can get recovery very short, boom, 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 three days, four days, then fresh, come back to train and start over yeah, again yeah. for heavy training. But women different. Women can stay training, yeah, yeah. Yeah. heavy training longer, let's say three weeks. Yeah. But their recovery also yeah. need longer. The recovery time mm. also need longer. Men may, let's say three days, yeah. but women need more than five days or one week. So because the women, uh, yeah. uh, recovery a little bit slow. So I just yeah, mentioned yeah. about yeah. this sport, weightlifting is a speed strain sport. We are different. Yeah. So this yeah. sport, and uh, not only we mention about the strength, I would say uh, mobility also important. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, when we do whatever clean, whatever snatch, we have to make sure we need a shortcut. Our movement must be by mechanic. So we don't need to make yeah. a, a second pull and a shiver's bar too high. We just make exactly what we need. For example, power snatch, different. You yeah. need to make sure you, you shiver the bar after contact to more than chest. Then you got room to catch for the overhead. But a full snatch is different. Full snatch, Depending on your mobility. If your mobility, your hip, your ankle, very flexible, you can make a squat very deep. You don't have to make a pull too high. I will say, yeah, yeah. some people, if good mobility, they can shift the bar after contact, they shift the end of the chest. Some people even close yeah, yeah. to the belly button, they still can make a catch, still can make an overhead yeah. because they squat yeah, yeah. very low. They can squat catch yeah. very low. So one of a girl from uh, Japan, you maybe you see the Olympics. Her clean or snatch almost touches the floor, touches the ground, because of mobility. Yeah. So yeah. this yeah, weightlifting exactly. nowadays, uh, people pay a lot of attention about mobility. If you improve your mobility, you will improve your strength. You improve your mobility, you will make more lift. You will improve your snatch clean yeah, yeah, numbers yeah. because. Uh, you can make a shortcut. We are not a machine. Yeah. We need to make a smart training. Okay. So smart training always yeah. by everything. Okay. So I would say, yeah. uh, I just mentioned this is a speed strength sport. Mobility yeah. important so that we can make a shortcut. Yeah. We always, yeah. we always, uh, focus with, uh, five words or we can say five elements. What is the five words? Yeah, yes. Yeah. So are you really teaching people? I tell them this is a GPS. If you totally understand what is the five words, you will make your technique perfect. So the first word is close. You have to keep your bar close so that it make it easier. This is the first word. That is the foundation, close. You have to make the movement with the speed. The second word we call fast. If you make it slow, you kind of lift, you have to make it fast. This is a speed sport. I just mentioned speed, speed sports, uh, whatever it is. The third word is low means you can, you need a squat lower. So catch deep, very deep. So the, there's a close, fast, low. The first three words, very important. Another two words you have to understand. How can make the movement shortcut? 
so that we can make good timing. So number four words is timing, or we can say the rhythm, rhythm. So like a, not like this. Yeah. So contact catch almost same time. So we make the timing perfect. So without any additional movement, we make a shortcut. So make a, you can save energy as well. So depending on mobility, if you can squat deep, you can make a really, really smoothly your movement. The last words, yeah. the number five words is stable. If you make a, you can make a speed. You can, uh, if you make close to the first words, you can make a second yeah. words fast. The yeah. number f- three words is a low. You can make a smoothly. If you smoothly, always go to timing. If uh, last, yeah. if the first four words is a perfect, last words stable, always perfect. Always you can make a stable. So these are five words. Yeah. I will recommend uh, our, our summary close, fast, low. Yeah. Stable. These five words for every yeah. weightlifter is their Thank GPS. You. I was saying GPS. So people will ask me, hey, Coach Ma, yeah. what is the difference in Chinese techniques and the European techniques? So people, a lot of uh, questions to me like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So I'm, uh, my answer is we always follow our movement, follow the biomechanic. We make a shortcut. We don't want to waste our yeah. energy because we are not a machine. We always try to make a smart. Yeah, yeah. So I would say China, weightlifting, especially the techniques, getting more and more uh, popular. People want to learn because they yeah, recognize yeah. that yeah, yeah. this is a, one of the best techniques. So European people, I know they are super, super strong. Okay. They are super strong. Yeah, yeah. It's true. They, are. they are use their own yeah. way their own way, their own techniques way. Okay. So I can say it's not reasonable. I just say, I recommend uh, people to use the Chinese way lifting. Okay. European style they yeah. still can use, but uh, compared with the Chinese style, I will recommend my student uh, to use the Chinese way lifting because we find yeah. this can save uh, energy, can avoid injury can stay our oh. sports life longer. For example, Lu Xiaojun, Chinese Olympia, Lu Xiaojun, yeah. three times Olympia. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He competed yeah, yeah. a couple of times Olympics, always a gold medal. He is uh, 37 yeah, yeah. years old. This month, he's, uh, oh, he's just uh, uh, passed uh, his uh, birthday, 37 years old. He still number one in the world. It is the reason that yeah, Chinese weightlifting is a uh, help the athletes the sports life longer the career yeah yeah you can yeah, see yeah. this is a great example that uh, athletes can stay longer okay so yeah sure yeah this is a, a, a great example so I just mention about yeah, this, is. Uh, the techniques different and uh, techniques also is a training method so we train with this techniques this is our method so I would say for the program Whatever you train, yeah. two weeks heavy or three weeks heavy, but always need to follow the recovery situation. And a man or woman, if you train with the one coach, as a coach, yeah. you need to understand men and women training should be different. Their endurance is different. You know, yeah. the body compensation is different. Some people, uh, you know, men and women, they, they are trained together. So men usually go too heavy quickly. They jump the yeah, yeah. jump the wall quickly, but women jump yeah. a little, little a very smaller. Especially at the competition, you can see the women jump like yeah, 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 yeah. three kilo, two kilo. No, usually like a, yeah. uh, under five kilo. But a, but a man different. Men can jump ten kilo, even fifteen kilo. They can jump a yeah, big yeah, yeah. jump. So they're good at yeah, this. Yeah, you're right. This is a, some some small stuff that different actually influence uh, their. Uh, the big stuff like training yeah. and uh, for the for the techniques uh, not only the five five uh, elements I'm also uh, remind athlete to to understand what is the Chinese way of doing gravity principle gravity principle so we always thought yeah. about grad uh, equal magnitude 
the body. So everyone will be different, yeah. but uh, our body, we have to make sure, try to uh, fully use our body energy. So yeah. this principle, equal magnitude, when we do the snatch or clean jerk, we make sure we need to use our energy from the whole body. Okay. But uh, what is yeah. the strongest area? We need to understand our, our glute, our legs is our engine is the strongest area. When we do snatch, yeah. that is the second pull. That is the time we need to use the whole body, especially the energy come from the legs and the, the butt, like uh, <laughs> the glue. Yeah, so yeah. Yeah. that is the engine I just mentioned. With that energy explosive for the second pull, yeah. you will make other, the other uh, part of the movement so easy. To, uh, yeah, you have to make sure you yeah. need uh, five words to make that movement make a shortcut. The so mostly. Yeah, okay. yeah. Simultaneous. I think that was. Many, yeah. First, word, uh, first principle is we call equal magnitudes. And uh, yeah. simultaneous means the same time. Your, your body is explosive yeah. in, the, in the same time. For snatch yeah, or clean or even jerk, we need to understand by uh, the movement need to, followed by mechanic, we need the opposite direction. We need the yeah. up, we also need the drop, we need the down. Yeah. We need the same yeah, time. Yeah. Many athletes, especially uh, beginners or even people get a wrong training or the coach didn't give uh, uh, coaching them well. There may be no experience. They always thought about going up for for pool, especially snatch. Yeah. I watch in the uh, American nationals also. Uh, uh, I saw that uh, I see that pe- uh, situation. Yeah, I told people, oh, it looks like a power snatch competition. It's not a full snatch competition. Everyone do power. They they are not good at a squat snatch. So I just mentioned that yeah. we need a opposite direction, yeah. simultaneous, equal management. Yeah. To make our movement yeah. shortcut, we don't need to do power. Power snatch, full snatch is much different. You know, you, yeah. you, you will spend a lot of energy for power because of distance. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. use the same energy, you just focus your timing so that you can make a shortcut for your full snatch. Full snatch means the squat yeah. snatch. It's just the opposite direction. So a lot of uh, athletes, uh, they yeah. have uh, their own way. They do power first, then they, they squat down. Yeah. So this is not a, yeah. yeah, this is a kind of like a two motion, three motion. But uh, the professional yeah. Chinese way of doing uh, snatch, we need a uh, one motion. You understand? Pa, yeah. go. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Boom, yeah. down right yeah. away. We don't need a pa up, then drop, drop, drop right away. Then, then, then you down right uh, down. after that. This is a big yeah, difference. Yeah, that's I think. This is the big difference. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I then see. people ask me, hey, uh, yes, yes. coach, you, 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 can you tell us about what is the difference, uh, European or Chinese way of thing? Besides the jump, the European, they, do, they, love, they love a jump. You know, they have a lot of a jump, jumping. Yeah, separate yeah, yeah. The p- platform, the jump. The Chinese athletes, most of athletes, the majority, we, we do like a just slide feet. On the ground, on the on yeah. the platform, slide feet. Yeah. That way, shortcut. You can do more. So you need yeah. to practice. The the movement quality come from the practice. The more and more practice, yeah. you can make it practice. That, you can make that muscle memory. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The muscle memory yeah, exactly. come from a long time training, many time training. Like uh, you know, yeah. English so. is my second language. You know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been learning this so hard, you know. One vocabulary, I need to read, read, read many, many times. Then I can, got to re- then I remember. Same thing for the accessory. Yeah, you're right. What if the accessory? Same thing. If you do muscle yeah, snatch. Yeah, 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 exactly. For example, snatch. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. Muscle snatch. If you do that, it's the first day for the muscle snatch. Yeah. You, you kind of make it perfect. But uh, the, you have to do many yeah, right. times, many times, many times. Repeat. Uh, if you have a good coach, tell you the yeah. correct one, 
then you just copy that. You make a practice, practice. Yeah. You need to yeah. you need to do a lot of uh, imitation to get that muscle yeah. memory. So when I learning the English uh, vocabulary, so one word I need to read, repeat eight times so that I get that uh, image uh, uh, Im impression, Im expression, yeah, yeah. expression. If you practice one time. I take one day off, three days off. You always got a, you kind of get, you always forgot. Yeah, you forget. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. This is the same. Story. So, coach, one question. Yeah. 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 So, uh, uh, you see, uh, you know, uh, I always ask that, uh, I get that question. What's the best age to start weightlifting or to teach weightlifting? And I mean, to general, not just weightlifting athletes for any athlete. Okay. What's the best age? Uh, nowadays, I see a lot of uh, younger kids, they train earlier, they start earlier, like uh, some people under eight, most of the people after eight, I would say they are reasonable. They can train, but uh, make sure they are not ready for a heavy one. I would say they can take time to learn some uh, basic techniques first, and also do some uh, uh, all kind of accessory to build their yeah, uh, body, uh, foundation, get some uh, strength little by little. You cannot rush because they are not mature, you know. So yeah, the, yeah. the younger kids they need to take time. So they need to build up little by little, step by step, follow their situation. People come from different family, different genetic. You know, some people mature earlier, and uh, men and women mature different time. Women, like a like girl, usually much one or yeah. two years earlier than men. The girl usually yeah, like yeah. mature maybe after 12 or 13. So at that time, no hesitate. You can, you can uh, get them to start the heavy, but uh, still little by little. Yeah, yeah. But uh, for boys, they mature late. You can't do too earlier for the heavy one. Yeah. 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 If they're they are still, uh, they are still not mature, so they need to uh, take time. Okay, there's a, there's a good saying in China, "Mo dao bu wu kan cai gong." These are Chinese words. Okay, that means for the fireworks, fireworks, the cut wood, yeah. cut the wood. Okay, if we use a socks, yeah, yeah. the socks is not yeah. sharp enough. It's not sharp enough. Yeah, you need to, you cut the wood. Took a long time. Yeah, you kind of cut. Yeah. But you, yeah, you yeah, sharp yeah. that first. Make a sharp first. You spend the time to sharp yeah, yeah. first. After that, boom, boom. Oh, finish quickly. That means yeah. take time and uh, get that foundation first. Okay? After yeah, that. That's important. That's important. After that, make it so easy. So good start, half done. Good start, half done. It's also Chinese words. Good start, yeah, yeah. half done. If your athlete start earlier, make a wrong start, you will be get in trouble. Some athlete maybe got injured. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. Some people yeah, right. even hurt the mental. If you give them training too hard, to let them to compete, the coach maybe no experience, let them to open up so higher, they bump out, then in her heart, <laughs> in their mind, they open yeah, yeah. Their, yeah, 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 yeah. They, they, they were hurt. They were always, yeah, yeah, you're right. always lovers with their future competition. So, for according to this this uh, uh, sample, I would say yeah, I think that's for the, the kids yeah. need to take time to train. Always follow their situation. Okay, the environment also important. Environment yeah. to encourage them to train. Yeah. More in, for get them more passion first. Passion, more enthusiasm. Yeah, yeah. Enthusiasm first to to follow uh, to uh, considering about their future uh, sport future, not uh, considering about the, just uh, in front of uh, time. You need to f thinking about their future, long future, long long term, long term plan. Yeah, yeah. You no, know, I just mentioned that. The kids that start around eight or ten or twelve. Yeah. I, I started when I was yeah. uh, twelve.
But before weightlifting, I doing I did a、uh, uh, track and field. I was a ten, ten, eleven. Yeah, yeah. I do that. But eventually, I、uh, recruited by the weightlifting team. So then I do、yeah. the amateur weightlifting at the sc- sports、yeah. school for about yeah, four yeah. years. I started professional when I was sixteen. It's not easy. So when I train, yeah, so boring at the beginning.、Uh, Why, why, why I say boring? Because、uh, not too much support. My family also、uh, worry about me doing some yeah, lifting. Yeah. They thought, oh, this will be yeah, yeah. dangerous sport. You will get an injury. So they are not supporting me. I, I do it by myself.、Yeah. I just interest.、Uh, I, I'm interested in that. So I doing yeah, yeah.、Uh, everything. I support by myself. So man, a woman. I just mentioned is different. Man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah. For training, at least for weightlifting training, if they want to become a higher level, international level, at least six years to eight years can become a high level. You can't rush. You can't say, yeah, yeah. "Oh, yeah, yeah, I train. I start today. Next year can become an Olympia.、Uh, next year can become a national yeah, champion. Yeah. Impossible. This is a long term sport. You have to stay. Yeah, you need to pay attention. Uh, pay. Uh, be patient to train. Take time to build up your foundation. Okay, for women, yeah, because they're much earlier. Women usually four to six years become a international level. Okay, yeah, only few uh girl or boy they have they have their own uh uh how is that the uh situation unique、different. yeah unique yeah, situation unique yeah, yeah. such as uh. Soleiman Oak, one of the super super、uh, strong guy, <laughs> Bulgaria. Yeah, yeah.、Uh, yeah, yeah. Turkey. Yeah. My friend, he passed away. Are there? We were nineteen、uh, eighties. We were at the same venue. We compete, but he he is a lightweight class, yeah, yeah. like a sixty kilo, sixty kilo class. He、uh-huh. was a sixty seven. Yeah. So we met each other a、yeah. long time, many times. <clears throat> so he compete Olympics. He compete world championships. Make a world champion when he was like a seventeen,、yeah. I think seventeen years old. Yeah, wow. He he he、so、young. very earlier, and also a Chinese、yeah. guy, Long Chen Chen. Long Chen Chen, Chinese、uh, weightlifter, is yeah, also yeah. two times Olympic champion, two thousand eight, two thousand twelve. Yeah, he two times Olympic champion. When he become a Olympic champion, when he was like eighteen. Seventeen, eighteen. He also very early. Wow, that's really yeah, unique.、Certain. Not everybody, majority. Yeah, yeah. At least for men, at least six, six to eight years. For women, at least four to six years. So need a time to train. So the foundation for everybody, yeah,、uh, need to build up、yeah. solid. Then you gotta make it make it successfully easily、uh, at the competition. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So if yeah, you okay, thanks. <clears throat> so, Yeah. Any question? Any more question? <clears throat> yeah. So、uh, co- you see, coach.、Uh, now most of the sports like football, basketball, tennis, table tennis. I mean, judo, wrestling, other sport. You know, they are doing weightlifting training as a part of their、uh, strength and conditioning. You know. So、yeah. how weightlifting training can、uh, help other sports <clears throat> to improve their performance?、Uh, Weightlifting will support all kinds of sport. Not only not only recent years, long many years ago, they already found、yeah. that weightlifting、uh, is a great uh, sport uh, to build them、uh, the strength, especially speed strength. Track and fields, and especially、uh, the shuffle, rifle.、Yeah. Yeah. Every athlete, their strength is. Almost every day, the strength, weightlifting, yeah,、uh, is a, one of the、uh, one of their most、uh, exercise they do. Yeah, not only they do track, the weightlifting almost like a, I would say, at least forty、yeah. percent or even fifty percent they do for weightlifting. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. They, they yeah, yeah doing, I can see. They are doing different is is they are not doing the full snatch, but they do full、yeah. snatch for sure. Okay. So what's the, is it okay? 
Yeah, yeah. That was actually my next question. So okay. which <clears throat> what which one is better? Which kind of weightlifting is better? Like you say, power clean, clean. I don't know. Power clean, power clean. Hang, yeah or power snatch, which one is better for us, for <laughs> other sport to practice? Uh, I will say, uh, uh, I know that all other sports, I, I saw them doing the power cleaning, but they are power cleaning, yeah. uh, a little bit different than weightlifting quality, for sure. They're different, they're the technical quality different. They make a split very wide, but weightlifting- we Yeah, 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 I mentioned, yeah, yeah, yeah. Very yeah. wide, but they have a lot of risk, a lot of uh, people, they got an injury when they're doing weightlifting training because they are they have no weightlifting techniques. So if they train uh, weightlifting, use a we, use yeah. a Chinese weightlifting techniques, I will say they will avoid a lot of uh, injury because uh, they are doing something is not uh, reasonable because their movement uh, has some uh, uh, risk. Because uh, once they do, for example, yeah. they do a split for power cleaning or even power snatch, yeah. they make so yeah. uh, very wide. So they are, they are, they are knee, you really get a knee hurt, got a new injury, knee. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sometimes they yeah, got I a, mentioned that. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Also, they got a uh, shoulder or elbow some way got hurt. Yeah. Because uh, if they do, for example, they do a power snatch, they don't know how to get an overhead because the weight of the overhead is different. We need a, yeah. we need a rotate the shoulders. But they yeah. they never rotate shoulders. They, they they should always make a lot of a uh, shake movement. You know? uh, yeah, yeah. Very soft. So yeah. with that balance, they have a lot of risk. They probably hurt the elbow, hurt the shoulder. So a lot of injuries they come from weightlifting training. Yeah. We can say. Yeah, oh, yeah, can't. yeah I see. Uh, many uh, other sports I know they're doing weightlifting. They get an injury. You can't say a oh, weightlifting is a bad sport. But the, yeah. the reason they got an injury because they have no techniques. You know, even they have a techniques, they will stay healthy. They will stay injured for free because the uh, weight, yeah, yeah. uh, weightlifting techniques, the weight, Chinese weightlifting, like a professional weightlifting techniques, uh, yeah. they need to get a reference. They need to learn so that they can um, yeah. help them to stay injured free. So just uh, yeah. back to your questions, what kind of, uh, what kind of, uh, uh, one of a uh, uh, what a kind of a uh, uh, exercise good for other sport. Yeah, yeah. Besides uh, snatch, or uh, I know people usually do power snatch or half squat snatch, yeah, parallel yeah. snatch. Yeah, or yeah. They do, yeah, yeah. Uh, power cleaning or parallel cleaning. They also need to to do deadlift, squat. Deadlift have yeah. two style, wide grip. Like a snatch grip, deadlift. Yeah, yeah. Clean grip, deadlift. The, we also have uh, another couple of uh, uh, an, another two style we call total back deadlift. The Chinese uh, athletes they, they created this. We created this uh, style on purpose. Yeah, yeah. Is more for strength purpose. It's not like a technique's uh, uh, purpose because uh, the back is a yeah. total back. They do that on purpose. Yeah, yeah. I can send you the uh, the sample video. You, you can yeah, take yeah, a look. Yeah, yeah. We also yeah, yeah. doing. Thank you. We also doing the uh, RDL. <clears throat> we call yeah, yeah. Romania deadlift. Yeah, yeah. Romanian deadlift, deadlift, Chinese deadlift, or the, they all need it. Yeah. Because this yeah, yeah. builds uh, the the whole back strength. Not only upper back, low back. Okay. When you when people are doing the deadlift. Yeah. People thought this is for back. Actually, not only yeah, back yeah. is also work on their the glute, the legs as well. Yeah, yeah. When you stand up, yeah, 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 exactly. Your legs also work. Your, your legs also uh, work for that uh, movement. Okay. So yeah, besides yeah. the deadlift, we have to understand the squat is also useful for other athletes to build their leg strength. Yeah. Whatever front squat, back squat. Sometimes we do a uh, half squat from a block to like a yeah, 90 yeah. degree, or we call parallel yeah. squat. Some people that do a box yeah, squat. Yeah. You know, the squat for every sport. Even I saw the Chinese shooting team long time ago. I have a yeah, yeah. I have my uh, I have my guy. Uh, he the name is a uh, Xu Haifeng. Maybe you know him. 
he he retired. Xu Haifeng, right? Yeah, he is yeah. one of he is a. I think of, I I know him. Yeah, yeah. he is the yeah. first Olympic gold medal for shooting for a Chinese team. Ah, first gold medal in Chinese Olympic history, first gold medal, nineteen eighty four. We were same wow. dedication. Yeah, yeah. When I saw him training, it is a we are same uh, like a, we we come from same uh, uh, province, Anhui. So yeah. yeah. I saw him use a squat. He also doing squat. The shooting guy, <laughs> shooter. Yeah, yeah. He doing squat. Why do squat? Because this, this sport, even the they they use the legs. They standing the long time. Yeah, yeah. If yeah, yeah, yeah. your legs no strength, like a chicken leg, <laughs> for example. Yeah, like yeah, a chicken yeah. Leg, yeah, yeah. Where you, where you influence your shooting, you you will make this because your legs. If your legs yeah, yeah. shake, they're not stable. You, yeah. Yeah. So. Even the shooting uh, athletes, they need the strength that they're doing the squat. You yeah. can imagine other sport, basketball, football, especially like the soccer. Wow, the leg strength so important, right? Yeah, they yeah, can, it is, yeah. They make a the the kick the uh, kick the ball, make it super fast, so they can go to the goal, right? So the yeah, yeah, right. leg strength so important. Exactly, we lived in. Can help them, the squat. Besides regular squat, I know that uh, track and fields, uh, wrestler, yeah. basketball, yeah. football, soccer, they do squat jump with the barbell, one jump. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Down, yeah, yeah. up, down, up. This is uh, very useful. That uh, for their sport with the barbell, yeah. they train. Okay. Yeah. So yeah. when uh, weightlifting training has so many accessory. All accessory will support uh, different sport. Uh, our accessory has a many uh, way. Yeah. For example, triceps. We we need yeah, to yeah. Do, we do snatch, clean jerk. If our triceps yeah. weak, yeah. we get a lot of risk. We got an injury. A lot of people uh, yeah. injury at the com- uh, competition because of the the intensity is too heavy. Yeah. So they dislocated. They got an injury. The mm-hmm. elbow. Yeah. Yeah. So now, as a coach, we always have never forgot about to build our weakness strong. We need to train our weakness to make a change, improve, so that make a super strong our small muscle. For snatch, clean jerk, some muscle we we are not training uh, uh, specifically. We need to train besides our uh, uh, like a. Uh, like a barbell training, we are also doing some yeah. dumbbell training, yeah, like yeah. bodybuilding to build our small muscle. Just mention about triceps. Yeah, yeah. triceps. Yeah, anyway. yeah, yeah. You can do this way down. You can do this way down. Yeah. You can do this way yeah, anyway. Yeah. Okay. We also yeah. do pull-ups, dips. We can say, oh, we can feel that. Oh, our shoulder, uh, the hips, but also triceps, also everywhere. So yeah. But uh, some so, muscle we yeah. use a specific exercise to build that uh, more intensity. Okay, so yeah, yeah. just mention that uh, so, this all exercise yeah. will support other sport for sure. But they need yeah, a, thank you. So they need a, they need yeah. techniques, <laughs> techniques to yeah, 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 for so sure. that can stay injury free. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, you see a lot of coach they go to training course, so they come to your training course, uh, they uh, learn uh, weightlifting technique for one, two days, and they go back and they practice uh, uh, those skills with their athletes. And usually, of course, they are not good. So how they need to start with that athletes? Because they came to the course after two days or three days course, how they need to start to train their athletes? So you mean the program? So I will say, yeah, 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 the program. So for strength training, I will say, you can you can make a many uh, many days uh, off, so I need to do frequently. I will say if the the whole week, at least for example, if you are not a weightlifter, you are soccer, for weightlifting you need to do at least every other day. I will say every other day to help you stay strong, so your body. So you- workers, sorry coach, sorry coach. So you see weightlifting means power. I mean, clean and jerk or weight training? Weight training. I talk about weight training means including yeah, the yeah. squat, deadlift. So yeah. whenever you use a barbell, 
whatever you use barbell, that is a, we call weightlifting training. We call barbell training, yeah, strength yeah. training. So yeah, yeah. strength training yeah, yeah. for all sport are necessary, or are very yeah. necessary. Uh, okay, even even our for example, even our ping pong team, it looks like yeah, every day yeah. they're moving like this, but they need the strength. Yeah, they, yeah. Need the, <laughs> they also do barbell training. They do dumbbell, barbell. They all yeah, yeah, need yeah. the strength training. Our strength training, you can you can do one day, take a, one week off. You can't do that. You have to do every other day around. Or yeah. I would say, if you are getting yeah. uh, old, uh, some people yeah. need injury, so maybe make something different. Yeah. <clears throat> but if you are regular athletes, you need to do uh, at least two or three times a week for other sport, make a, for, yeah. uh, for example. So yeah, you yeah. can't do one day, uh, take uh, one week off. So that does not make sense because your body cannot get used yeah, to it. Yeah. Also, f- even weightlifter, how we how we can make, make uh, our numbers improve? Snatch, can and jerk. Yeah. If if you are heavy weak, for example, two or three yeah. is heavy. If you are heavy weak, you cannot you never touch the heavy. For example, you never touch ninety percent. You will feel so difficult to get that ninety percent more than ninety percent at the computation because you never touch that. So then you cannot get used to it. You have to overcome yeah. to get that yeah. intensity training so that your muscle get a muscle memory. It also help yeah, you yeah. to build up your confidence because you never touch heavy. Yeah, yeah. Once you go to competition, you're always nervous because uh, yeah. the intensity of there is a hundred, almost 100%, 90% of it, but you never yeah, touch. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, whatever yeah, yeah. your weightlifter or other athletes, if you train weightlifting, you need a you need to understand. Not only we do volume, more volume. We need to do. We need to make sure our intensity will be do a uh, touch heavy uh, frequently. So intensity is a key for strength training. Yeah. If we never touch heavy, your body never get a training. So only your intense, your only the volume intensity combining. So your muscle get yeah. a stimulation. Your muscle get a stimulate uh, so that. Uh, yeah. To get something change, the quality change. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, yeah. I don't know how to use, uh, describe about this, but uh, I will. I understand that uh, when I train athletes, I always focus their intensity, depending on their quality. At least yeah. once a week, we max out during the heavy week, for example. Yeah. So if the six days training, six days per week, Monday is yeah. heavy. Okay. Yeah. More than ninety percent. Some people at least eighty-five percent. Tuesday heavy, yeah. but do something different. More strength training. Wednesday heavy again, but is a uh, yeah. Make a more uh assistant exercise such as uh, yeah, yeah. other yeah 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 assistant uh, power yeah, yeah. push press. Thursday yeah, yeah. depend. Some people need a day off. The or they, yeah. or you, they can do some uh, light training for recovery purpose. Yeah, but yeah. Friday, max out. Chinese weightlifting, the team, every team, they have a almost the same system, almost similar. Friday, most yeah, yeah. of the team, they are uh, mess out, mess out day. They, 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 yeah, they yeah. always go yeah, heavy. Yeah. Okay. But yeah, yeah. Saturday, they still can stay heavy, but do something different, such as muscle yeah. snatch, power snatch, yeah, yeah. power snatch, or power clean push press, or squat. So the exercise select. By must be uh, follow the situation. Actually, the recovery situation. Yeah, yeah. You know, we cannot yeah, yeah. do squat every day. I know people focus about their strength training, especially legs. Always talk about legs. Yeah, yeah. Hey, how can I build our legs? Can we do squat every day? We are not recommending <laughs> squat every day because uh, we are not a machine. Yeah, yeah. Our yeah, knee, yeah. right. Our knee. Once we got an injury, wow, it's so hard to get a recovery because the knee is a uh, very very different, very sensitive. Once you get a knee hurt, yeah, yeah. then yeah. it's hard to get a 100% recovery because you always hurt, you feel different. Yeah, yeah, you dam- yeah, if, yeah, yeah. Uh, if you hurt, like damage, you know? So yeah, yeah. young people, they train, the coach need to pay attention with their recovery. Have to follow their situation to make a good program so that avoid yeah. injury. So training like this, heavy, heavy, uh, heavy, 
da heavy yeah yeah like this we training like this way but yeah, we yeah. improve like this yeah yeah yeah, we yeah improve yeah, yeah. this much <laughs> training like this way <laughs> so we kind of train bah, heavy, exactly then crush then finish yeah so we need to yeah. uh, always follow our situation people i just mentioned from a different uh, background different experience different genetic different recovery yeah. situation also gender difference too men and women also different okay some people yeah uh they're thinking too much so the mental not good because they're, yeah, yeah, yeah. they're thinking too yeah, much yeah. they always nervous hesitate when they do a heavy one yeah they kind of sleep yeah, yeah. In China, I know you. Maybe you are uh, you're familiar, familiar with the, the uh, athlete there. Yeah, yeah. The coach always reminds athletes to write the diary weekly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. After training, write down your your experience about your training, your performance, your field, yeah. your recovery situation. Uh, give the coach feedback. Give the feedback to the coach. Coach read the, your feedback. Then. Understand much more you yourself your 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 situation. Then easy to yeah. coaching you. Uh, yeah, very easy to uh, like uh, to handle the the training. If the yeah. athletes not write the uh, diary, no feedback, or even no yeah. one talk to the coach, it's not smart because the coach yeah they coach doesn't know your situation. Sometimes they. He doesn't know how many hours you sleep, what kind of food yeah, yeah. you eat, you know, how much stress for you you have. Coach doesn't know. But uh, if yeah, you yeah. write that's, down that's... the notes, uh, diary, to tell the coach, then coach understand so that you can work it closely with the coach to help you yeah. more. And so always yeah. smart yeah, training, smart work. Yeah, yeah. The coach has a responsibility to take care about you depending if you work closely with the coach so any yeah. other sport same thing every sport the same you know Chinese way yeah, exactly is yeah. a professional sport so yeah, at yeah. least uh, you uh, people uh, always uh, want to go to China with me for the camp I will start a yeah, camp yeah. maybe next year but this year is hard because of the pandemic but I will yeah, consi yeah. consider it to organize the camp for summer and winter so yeah. I want to tell people that if anyone interested, talk to me. Ma Wei Lebi yeah, on yeah. Instagram. Ma Wei Lebi on Instagram. Okay, on Facebook. So, and I will say, uh, Great. just now I mentioned that uh, other sports, they need the Wei Lebi training, but make sure they need the good techniques. Good techniques, they need it. So once they have yeah, good yeah. techniques, then training should be easier. So because they can make a good movement, Stay safe, yeah. Improve quickly, okay. I will say, uh, the end of the year, if uh, open China open, I will have yeah. a seminar in uh, Guangzhou. So maybe we can each, uh, yeah, know, uh, meet each other there. Also, yeah, yeah, I saw, yeah, yeah, yeah. For I sure. know your team. Yeah, looking if forward. You, if you invite me to your team, I will go there. <laughs> to uh, for sure, for sure, yeah, that will be our honor. Some, uh, for sure, I can do the uh, workshop, wedding evening workshop. Okay. Yeah, yeah, for so sure. So we can for uh, sure. train okay, your athletes. Honor in details you know uh, i have a yeah. lot of seminar around the world right now that the people invite me i usually do two days sometimes we do one day always yeah different two days more details but uh, i also have a uh, one day seminar but uh, people we're learning quickly but uh, i would say uh, for regular uh, seminar i do first day one yeah. do snatch day two for yeah. clean jerk yeah the training very easily, so the 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 all accessory very uh, we train also get a lot of time for practice. So yeah. people learning quickly, they make a yeah, good yeah. Imp uh, make a improvement right away. So I just done a seminar in uh, Florida uh, yeah, yeah. two days ago. I think uh, people enjoy. So in the future and uh, yeah, yeah. and uh, we can continue to get a broadcast interview. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. We can. Yeah, 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 for a, sure. yeah, yeah. If people have a, a question to you, and uh, we can yeah, discuss, yeah. <clears throat> discuss about uh, their question, we can yeah, share, yeah. Uh, share my experience. I can answer any question they have. Okay, yeah.
yeah, yeah, for sure. We'll do more in yeah, yeah. future. I think today, <laughs> and you, yeah, you shared a lot of uh, information, <laughs> important <laughs> details. You know, a lot of things. Especially, yeah, especially <laughs> we don't. A lot of coaches in the world, they don't know. They are not familiar with Chinese weightlifting. They know, oh, they are the best in the world. They are getting a lot of mm. results in Olympic. They were, they were amazing in Tokyo. And they, they, they had a lot, they have a lot of questions they want to ask or they want to get information. How was, what's the secret? And I think today you share a lot of interesting you know, uh, uh, information. I think they get the idea and uh, I think in future, yeah. Yeah. I think uh, uh, I'm still learning because uh, weightlifting, they bad. So the training methods and uh, they yeah. bad. Uh, recent years, I when I do the seminar or coaching uh, at the different gym, yeah. I see all kinds of people. Yeah. The, something, uh, yeah. uh, some some part I uh, pay my attention that, especially the, I uh, just mentioned that, mobility. Wow. Yeah, yeah. I see a yeah, lot yeah. of uh, uh, people, uh, middle age, they train this, uh, CrossFit. Yeah. They tra uh, train CrossFit, but yeah, yeah. their mobility is so bad. <laughs> yeah, I'm also not a good yeah, 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 yeah. because uh, uh, I I know that this is so important. So I was yeah. happy that yeah, I get a, uh, my uh, my weightlifting get a certificate by the N, uh, NCSF uh, organization yeah. uh, for mobility certificate. Mobility. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> so weightlifting, I just mentioned that not only strength, we need a uh, uh, pay attention for train for uh, strength. Yeah, yeah. But also we need a yeah. yeah. Mobility, coordination. Yeah, yeah. Mobility, uh, mobility coordination. coordination. Yeah, I think. You know, uh, yeah, yeah. I've been coaching a lot of uh, students. I I see that yeah. they are everyone different. Some people are super strong. Yeah. But yeah, yeah, yeah. They are not a good at coordination. Is yeah, yeah. also bad. Yeah. So, after I mentioned about uh, mobility, I now I want to talk about a little bit of coordination. Coordination is uh, important. Yeah, for sure. Once you have a good coordination, your movement will make it very natural. Yeah, because uh, yeah. you're flexible, your reaction fast, your movement very smooth. So coordina coordination yeah. support your movement, make it very natural. So I have yeah, experience, yeah. I coaching yeah. uh, two athletes before in China. I record from uh, other yeah. province, like Hulan province. One yeah, yeah. is a little bit weak at the beginning and uh, good yeah. techniques, good mo uh, good mobility, good coordination. The other one, super strong and uh, yeah. so so for coordination. But uh, eventually I choose the one who has a good coordination. Then I didn't record yeah. the other one who are stronger than this one. So eventually this one make a world champion after a few years. Wow. But the other one yeah. also Congratulations. Went, to went to other gym. Nobody, uh, yeah. nobody recording her because yeah. we all found that he has no coordination. Her coordination not a good. So the one, yeah, yeah, yeah. The one, uh, good coordination, good techniques, mobility, everything good. Yeah. Eventually, he yeah. may, she make a world champion. Her name is Li Ping. For a fifty-three, Li Ping. yeah, I heard. Li Ping. 53 kilo category, world record holder, and snatch 105, yeah. Canadian 135, 38. Yes, I forgot her uh, Canadian, but I remember her snatch was a 105. I coaching her before I come to US. So <clears throat> uh, she yeah. is great. And uh, yeah, she is a sample that she has a great coordination. Yeah. yeah. Mobility, everything good. Yeah. yeah. And uh, the yeah, strength, yeah. I built up her little by little, eventually she also super strong. But uh, yeah, I I coach, uh, I recorded her because of the coordination. So the coordination that is coordination. Uh, coordination is important. And the combination, yes, yes. many people miss the snatch or clean jerk because yeah. coordina coordination not good. Because the body not, yeah. not listen to them. And yeah, so yeah. He's thinking that way, yeah. but uh, the body not listen. Yeah. But you, if you have yeah. a good uh, coordination, your body always follow you. Always, <laughs> you understand? Know they have a good yeah, GPS. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah they yeah, have a good GPS, yeah, yeah. you know? Yeah, this yeah, is yeah, yeah. So for- Yeah, thank as, you. As a, yeah, as a professional coach uh, in China, because uh, every team, they have a limited budget, always uh, focus with a 
pay attention with the, their selection. Always select the good one, good genetic one. Yeah. So that way, yeah, yeah. I just mentioned that these materials, they start, good start, half done already. So you don't need to worry. Yeah. If you have a good materials, yeah. boom, 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 couple of years, the materials become superstar. You yeah. Know? Yeah. 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 So, yeah. Yeah, exactly. For you. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, Any more questions? yeah, exactly. Thank you, coach. Yeah, that was yeah. all question. Uh, do you need want to add something? Yeah, that was all question we have today. I think, yeah, uh, thank you very I, much for your, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, yeah, go I ahead. enjoy it to uh, discussion with you about the Chinese weightlifting techniques, uh, strength training, and the programming, uh, training too. program uh, method. So I would say in the future, we can uh, uh, talk more others about uh, training, okay? And uh, yeah, yeah, my okay. my company, Ma sure. Weightlifting, uh, is a uh, Ma Weightlifting. Uh, yeah, I coaching athletes uh, worldwide. Yeah. So and uh, yeah, yeah, I want to get a more uh, uh, opportunity so that I can help people to learn Chinese weightlifting. So if anyone interested, uh, contact me at Ma Weightlifting on Instagram. My email, Ma Weightlifting <laughs> at Gmail dot com. Okay, my website, coachma.net. <laughs> that is my channel. Great, great. Okay? Thank yeah. you. Thank you. I think, I mean, yeah, I think uh, Coach Ma is one of the qualified coach, one of the top coaches in weightlifting in the world with experience with many countries, many athletes all around the world. So it's he, he knows what's the problem with weightlifting in different countries, with different uh athletes you know he has experience with many ages different with girls boys so if you want to learn weightlifting just go to my weightlifting in his instagram facebook or website contact him and i think you will learn a lot he's a very he's one of the top coaches thank you coach uh, thank you in us this you, time everybody. and uh, uh keep contact again. and <laughs> see you again Thank okay. you very much. Have a good okay. day. Good.